centers mm-hmm. that are being managed by house girls mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. chamber boys mm-hmm. i'm telling you mm-hmm. nearly 90% of those companies mm-hmm. that are being managed by uh, shamba boys mm-hmm. house girls but the people behind those companies are ministers government big government officials That's true so we need to do something thank you there you are Let's now come to Somalia. Mali and uh, there's a new political upheaval uh, arrest following the arrest of a former Al-Shabaab leader who is running for a regional election and that has sparked deadly clashes in the southern Somali city of Baidoa and uh, it's, the situation is very fragile right now. Now, this guy was a was a was a militant but yes. he reformed he went to the government they made peace and he's actually reformed and people like him. So his campaign slogan is i knew how to found to to found al shabab and i know how to finish them so actually somalis have backed this guy up but the government doesn't want this guy to run so they they arrested him and this is causing problems which means the government wants al shabab to remain to continue, <laughs> to continue. <laughs> because if you have somebody yeah. who knew how to to form because someone has come he has reformed he has a solution. and then he has said i have the solution yes. because i've been in it mm-hmm. and i can clear it and then you arrest him it means you don't want that to stop mm-hmm. there is something behind it happening mm-hmm. now we need to ask who is al shabab now mm-hmm. <laughs> that guy who has been reformed mm-hmm. he will may he may tell us what is really happening there mm-hmm. so maybe he was arrested because he was now going to get the real person the al shabab cousin so guy. Now, it's a very interesting twist here his name is robo and he was arrested by somali police backed by ethiopian peacekeeping why is ethiopia getting itself into this are they supporting al shabab no ethiopia uh, ethiopians released him is it Ethiopia who that released them together with the with the Somali police yes. the Ethiopian peacekeepers but the Africa Union peacekeeping mission in Somali has come out to to say they are not part of the arrest yes then Ethiopia itself mm-hmm. is it Ethiopia that released him because i know all the gymnastics there mm. is it Ethiopia that released the guy from prison no the guy is still in custody and it's causing problems right now in Somalia yes but the door is controlled by Ethiopia mm. yes and Ethiopia is trying to link the new opening between mm-hmm. Eritrea and and Ethiopia puts Al Shabab we shall be collecting them like insects mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> because mm-hmm. they will not have a backup mm-hmm. they used to have a backup position where they run back mm-hmm. after killing people mm-hmm. they run back to mm-hmm. either Eritrea without mm-hmm. Eritrea knowing mm-hmm. or Eritrea knowing mm-hmm. but now there is an opening to each for all to mm. fall mm. so what i think ethiopia has done was to detain this guy mm. so that they can actually find out who is the real the real al shabab yes uh, because they, they'll come and, out. And, and, and why why there's that worry mm-hmm. is that we're about to find the leaders of al shabab okay and i have been on this platform say the time and the time again mm. that leaders of al shabab can be easily be traced and uh, mr madam fatu besuda mm. can issue a warrant mm. of arrest mm. if you know the names you issue a warrant of arrest mm. people will look for these guys yes why why is it that let's ask this question mm. why did madam fatu besuda mm. fail to issue a warrant yes. for boko haram mm-hmm. for al shabab yes then issued for errare now that's uh, double st- you know, why uh, uh, double standard. Uh, have, yeah. have you seen yeah yeah because the rules uh. must be finished yes there uh-huh. Uh-huh. the warrants were uh-huh. issued against the errare yes why are we not issuing a warrants against al-shabaab yes we know the leaders one of them is the one you have detained in mm, mm. in, in your body door yes yes why don't you issue 10 warrants yes and they say we say shake mohammed shake abdu shake yeah. this one shake, shake we are shake. needed all the, all the shakes we have a caller <laughs> but you see a caller from german yes caller hello. hello put on the microphone caller from german from germany i'm calling from italy italy not germany sorry I thought it was 49. 
I'm from Italy. Yeah, go ahead. Interview him. Go ahead. Hello, go ahead. What is your question? What is your name and what is your question? I'm very happy for, for what you people are doing for concerning Nigerian problem. Mm -hmm. Okay. My name is Obina from from Delta State, Biafra. Okay. Thank you. So you people should help us to beg Nigerian government that we need referendum. Okay. The, the most important problem is uh, Buhari and uh, Atiko and uh, Babangida with uh, this uh, man from uh, Ota called. Uh, uh, what is his name? Uh, Abba Sanjo. Uh -huh. I told you. <laughs> you can to help us to beg them because uh, we need referendum. We need to go away from the, from, from the fucking animal country they call themselves to be. They call Nigeria. We need a referendum. Please, you people, should, the, all the whole world should help us to beg them because we don't need fight. We need freedom. Thank you. Thank you. We never see countries that all of them they are in they are running down to Europe here to treat themselves when they are sick or when their children sick or when they are when they want to go to school they bring their children to to Europe to, to London to go to school. But there is no good school in Nigeria. There is no life. There is no road. Imagine country that someone can stay from a year to year without without you use your money to go and buy fuel, buy generator. You can't see light for your life. Mm -hmm. You can't see food to eat. You can't see nothing. Look at everybody. All Nigeria children, all the Afro children, they are running away from from the country to this military mm -hmm. They die there to take risky to enter to just to to find something to take care of themselves. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We Thank you. Random. We Thank you. to the Nigerian government. Mm -hmm. Thank, you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much, my brother. You are beating children not to cry. You are beating children to hold their mouth not to cry. They are beating children to hold their mouth not to cry. They are beating children to remember that one day, Nemesis will hold them. They will die. They will die. Even though they will not be able to have any support to fight them, God will fight them back. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You I'm happy for your for your for your contribution for your for your wasting your time to to just because of Nigerian problem or because of Biafra. Thank, thank you. you. And thank you for your contribution. Thank you. God bless you people. We need the referendum. We appreciate your We need the referendum. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The man is even crying mm. tears. That is one of our viewers all the way from Germany. From no no from no, Italy. 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 Oh, is it Italy. Italiano Sicily. Mm. Milano. Si, Milano. Milano. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> Somalia. Mm. Then we have Balito controlled by Ethiopians. Mm -hmm. Ethiopians. Have you ever seen a bullet in Ethiopia? In a bomb? Mm -hmm. Just recently, short. Yeah, no, but that is after. Yeah, the, after. But the previous no, before no, no, no. Dr. Never, Ahmed Mohammed ne uh, uh, came. Never, never, never. Why? And they, and they have they, a bigger board. Can I tell you yeah. why? Yeah. <laughs> tell me. And they share a bigger board. Do you know yeah. the mm. hottest area on African continent? Mm. Where is it found? In Ogaden. Mm -hmm. So, you know, add the dots, I don't want to say it. Mm, mm. So, when they get their shabab, mm. the Ethiopians leave them around there. <laughs> so, you, fun. No, you find your way. <laughs> <laughs> hey. There are so many things happening. <laughs> Uganda is the only country in the world that yeah. allows a Somali yeah. without a visa. Did you know that? I didn't know. Give it credit to Museveni. Yes. 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 President Apo Nafanya has. Yeah. But we allow you on a condition. Discipline. Discipline and don't <laughs> don't bomb us. <laughs> yes. That's the truth. Yes, yes, yes. That's why you I talk the truth because as a, 
I must I must give credit to Musebeni. Yes. Some people don't give credit. Yes. Yes. Give yes. credit you are, even if you disagree with the man. Yes. Give him credit on security. Yes. Musebeni has done very well. Has done very well. Security. True. Yes. Musebeni. So you enter, you enter now to this. Yes. You want to come to kill us. So somebody is went back and declared and said, Ah, Jamin, Uko, Musikende Uko. Now don't go there with anything. Mm. But there is something bigger. Mm. Mm -hmm. But Kenya, you've been so kind. No, I'm just so you. kind because you are at the frontier mm. and the, there's a porous border. Mm. And there is a, there are double standard people in Kenya. Just yes. be very yeah. honest. They, they don't tell the truth. Yeah, yeah. Others, others are not going to protect, they are going to do business. Yes. Okay, yeah. There is that business is, competition. There have been evidence here. Yeah. Charcoal business competition. And, yes. and sugar. And the sugar. And sugar. <laughs> you saw when, when 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 you look at the sugar. Uh, well, let's be very honest. Uh, Uko Uganda. Uh, the richest Uganda, among the richest Ugandan uh, is a Somali. Yes. The man who has built the the best restaurant where everybody mm. wants to mm. struggle for a seat. Mm. Mm. You didn't have one like that in Kenya. Mm. Where was it? Mm. <laughs> no, where was it? <laughs> CJ is who's? Mm. Do you know the owner of CJ I on don't Koinange know. Street? I don't have know. you been there? I've never been there. Try but to I'll, get food I'll there. Go, I'll go there. Right? Call me for lunch right? or Somali, call us. Somali mm. restaurants I'll go there. Actually. That yeah. CJ is owned by a Ugandan, a friend of mine. I know him. Mm. Somali, mm. who has stopped him from doing business? Yeah, yeah. But he has well. sat down the rest of the Somalis, told them, please, uh. we do business here. Yeah, yeah. This country allows us without visa. Uh, uh. Once you have a genuine Somali passport, mm. who can allow you with a Somali passport? <laughs> <in any way? laughs> How do you even know it's original? Uh, uh -huh. yeah. But uh. for us, we have we've struggled, mm. but we have a, a deterrent, mm. a deterrent. Mm. Hey, mm. the things that stopped Baba from crossing, mm. uh, crossing the river, the river Jordan, uh, the, uh, the crocodiles uh, and the hippos. Don't think, don't think, don't think. You you put With the sharp teeth. <laughs> 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 Do you know that? <laughs> If you are swallowed by a crocodile, mm -hmm. there is no DNA. Yeah, no DNA. All right. You're done. <laughs> <laughs> so you can finish the rest of the story. Yes. Yes. If there are 600 crocodiles hungry, <laughs> yes. <laughs> what can they do? Big damage. Yes. Deterrent. Mm -hmm. mm. A deterrent. Mm. Since then, Ethiopia does not have. The Problems bomb is the headquarters of mm -hmm. AU. Mm -hmm. Have you seen anybody planting a bomb there? No. Ethiopia, if there is a problem, they pour 200,000. You know, Ethiopia has got an army of about 80 million people. Mm. It can pour 300,000 mm. at a go. 300 are like ants everywhere mm. you move. <laughs> yeah? mm. Look, mm. You see the tactic that Kony used to have. Yes. yes. Kony could pour 40. They jump on the trees like a monkey. <laughs> so SPLA, once they see the trees shaking, all of them start running <laughs> towards the, the, the Sudanese interior. Uh. The, poor, the tactic that Ethiopia uses, in, if, the, if you give, let me tell you, if you had given Ethiopia mm. and the Uganda, mm. today, mm. there would be no... <laughs> There will be no terrorism. Mm. Do you know mm. why? Mm. Mm -mm. Everybody mm -mm. will be in the Indian Ocean. All of them. <laughs> I, yeah, the people who remain there will be clean. <laughs> <laughs> will be <purged. laughs> that, is, that is the strategy yes. that Museveni wanted. Mm. But then European Union came in and said, oh, human rights, human rights. You get the point. And what were they protecting? But they are protecting the French who want to protect their interest. The interest. Yeah. They have now you yeah. see why the confusion is coming in the Somalia yeah. before we leave Somalia because we it is crucial to KDF. Yes, yes. And uh, the, the, the bosses here of security watching this program better mm. listen to this. Mm. The French have gone there. Yes. They have removed United Arab Emirates yes. out. Yes. And they have come in. 
promising the current pre uh, Somali president mm -hmm. a lot of goodies. Yes, yes. Just as they promised Mangofuri, mm. a lot and of goodies. goodies. And then they departed. <laughs> they went away. They didn't tell him they were not yeah. coming back. Mm. Now Mangofuri said he can't accept gay or lesbian marriage. Mm. Mm -hmm. But most of the people who are working on the rare are lesbian <laughs> and, uh, and, uh, and are gay. So at night in the tents, things start working more. So the intelligence of Tanzania said, Hello, but these people have no wives. <laughs> But we don't know why the tents keep on shaking. shaking. The, the people like, digging. As if there were generators. Uh -huh. <laughs> as if there were 90 generators. I'm sorry, <laughs> Miriam. But this happens as usual in a Christian mm. way. We are not talking badly. No, it's okay. The, 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 the tents started making generation. Uh. So Mangufuru found out in the morning, said, no, he's not going to accept this. Mm. You are telling me not to have any lesbian. Mm. In a, a, to to allow people to marry. Yes. No. Cut your aid. French mm. were the first. Mm. The railway between Tanga and Mwanza mm. has suffered. Yeah. yeah. Setback. Yes. I, I, Uganda and other countries have to rethink. Rethink again. Mm. And come back to lapset. Mm. To lapset. So it the, the situation in Somalia is being complicated mm -hmm. by the French involvement. Mm. Yeah which we see now taking a new direction. Mm. That new direction will cause us the biggest problem that we have never seen before. Yeah, but as much as that is, uh, this guy, the, the former um, Al-Shabaab leader, mm. his name is Mukhtar Robo, do you know they had to push the election forward three times so that means he, he is somebody that cannot be dismissed in the somali politics yeah they pushed it so that they rig him mm. but he also became unriggable mm. yeah <laughs> Isn't it? yeah they couldn't rig him yeah. mm -hmm. so Important. finally they put the election he won yeah <laughs> now if you are trying to pacify somalia mm -hmm. how do you pacify somalia and let me teach here some people. You cannot stop that conflict without the head, the heart, and the stomach. Mm -hmm. If one of these is missing, mm -hmm. terrorism will not go away. Yeah. Why don't we get refrigerated containers? Yes. Give to Somali youths yes. who are recruited by Al Shabaab. Yes. Ask them to be bringing us a hundred. 100, 100, 20,000, 10,000, 100 guns, AK 47, for a refrigerated container yeah. to go with a boat to go and fish. Yes. And put your fish in the, con in the refrigerated container, sell it to those, you know, the people who yeah. steal fish. Yes, yes. Do you yes. know the, the thieves of fish? Uh, uh -huh. <laughs> Do you know them? Mm -hmm. Filipinos. Filipinos. <laughs> Japanese. Mm -hmm. Swedish. Mm -hmm. Chinese. Mm -hmm. They are stealing fish here. Yeah. And, and selling, that, and selling, selling it to back. So, so protect the waters of Somalia. Somalia. Give them refrigerators. Yes. And then let them do Go the fish. The fish and, and then sell to the trawlers. So you would have yeah. you finish the conflict. Have empowered yeah. Yeah. And you finish the shark here. Yeah. <laughs> How can the youth stand on yes. on, on, on yes. the mainland? Yes. Watch big ships taking yeah. their ship. Yeah. Their fish. Yeah. With nothing. And when they get hold of that ship, they uh, say they are what? Pirates. Pirates. People come and bomb, bomb them. Bomb them. So let's try another method. They need food. Mm -hmm. They need money. Yes. They have the heart. Yes. Somalia has got one, the language. Yes. The religion. Yes. The clans. Yes. They know each other. Yes. If they get each clan gets 20, 50 containers. Yes. They will have an occupation to do. Yes. Why do they want to come and kill people? We should think about that. Mm -hmm. Other than these people stealing, the biggest thieves are Japanese and the Filipinos. Yeah. And the, those, and the Swedish. Mm -hmm. They live because in in those waters of Antarctic they can't fish with that big net. Yes. You see the president here introducing that thing called the maritime blue economy. Yes. Where yes. Songo spoke a different language. Yeah. <laughs> 
he spoke in tongues in tears yeah. Yeah. <laughs> when yeah. governor soko yeah. talked aloud mr kinyara is the things you know Sorry. let's be very honest there is there is a lot uh yes honorable mm. you can learn from this mm. there is something going on mm -hmm. that we don't know mm. that makes africa mm -hmm. ungovernable mm -hmm. yes when the french now enter mogadishu yes you see all manner of try or problems coming including mm. our kdf will mm. be affected mm. Mm. because soon those somalis will return on nationalism mm -hmm. and they will start finishing our people mm. Mm -hmm. so let's prepare an exit yes true a good exit yeah mm -hmm. yeah a good plan not now yeah, not now but prepare an exit yes while you tell them this is a refrigerated container one boat bring me 50 ak-47 yes yes you know how many will come mm. they know where they a are lot. you tell me the people killing people people planting bombs in mogadishu mm. you think those people don't know them they know ah, ah you think they don't know them they know them. where do they sleep mm. they sleep in those hotels but because people are saying what are we gaining here mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. if the french are coming to tell us that there is oil here where you see it is plenty mm -hmm. so they want to say we are the ones who helped you now we want to take it mm -hmm. that's what they did in libya thank you very much madam mm -hmm. And thank you very much. And that's the Terry. There is a problem here. <laughs> Cabinet shake up rooms over handshake, graft, and a patch. Uh, Mr. Livondo says we talk. You want us to talk about yeah, it? Yes, important. Mm -hmm. let's, yeah. let's finish it. Let the president get. Let the... me ask you whom mm -hmm. on your lips mm -hmm. you want to go. <laughs> Where? Anybody? Ah, ah, nani unambayo metaka aende? Sema yaki. The, the guy that is the the person who is destroying Mao uh -huh. should go. Topico. Should go. Mm -hmm. Name them. This television is an apologetic. Yeah. An account. Uh, and then the, because we have facts. Yes. We have rollies. Mm -hmm. He banned the, the, the charcoal. Yes. If if Tobiko wants to sue us, yes. we can arrest those yes. rollies. Let's yes. go with a roadblock yes. yes. of good policemen. Be, be, because no, let the president give us not this ordinary police. Yes. Easy policemen from state house. Yes. We lay roadblock at the at uh, the junction of Mamayu. Ah! Junction of my uh -huh. yeah. Mr. President, very early in the morning, you will find we have impounded over 900 uh, yes. lorries. So, yes. Tobiko can't show us. Yes. You put the ban. Where is the ban working? Yes. We are number one.